So today we're going to be doing a flat twist out using the Myel Organics Twisting Souffle. I've had this product since it first came out. I've probably used it like two times at the most. If you could see, um, yeah, you see like the jar is pretty full. So today I'm just going to be using the Myel Leave-In. This is my favorite line, by the way, if you didn't know. Well, for at least wash and go, so hopefully this will be good, this twisting. And then I'm just using... Uh, an oil mixture, the vitamin, this is black castor oil and the Curls Blueberry Bis Wild Growth Oil. So I just mixed it in there so it's easier to apply to the scalp. So you guys kind of know how I do my twist outs already. I'm not going to go into too much detail or video of that. But I kind of just want to do like a mini product review type thing. So you can see how it works, whether you should purchase it or not. So I'm just sectioning, sectioning off a piece of hair. This is like enough to twist. The thinner your hair section the more defined the twist will be but you guys see the leave in you know how that is already if you have not seen my other videos on this product um then you know you should watch it i kind of just start on like like i kind of start on damp hair i don't sweat it fully um, but I don't, I mean, I make sure it's not super dry. So alone, you guys can see the leave-in in action. And the leave-in gives my hair so much moisture. And it kind of helps with definition too. So if you want to do just do a leave-in, you can. I like to do the LCO method, as you guys know. So, wait, here. So see me taking a little bit of this. I'm going to rub it. Ooh. It's super thick. I rubbed in my palms and I'm just gonna evenly distribute it throughout my hair that I'm about to twist up and you can run your fingers through it if you want um, just you know do what's best for you and this like I said this cream is there's a twisting souffle so it's best for twist and braid outs so we'll go over all that though when I review it when I take this out so now that I've got this nice and moisturized and defined, I don't think, I don't know, I like gels better, but I didn't want to use this with a gel, I kind of wanted to just see the product itself. So I'm going to take some oil, put that directly on my scalp, and then I pour a little bit on my hands, rub it together, and rub it into my hair. And I kind of like do a mini massage on my scalp. And I do this literally every time. I do a wash and go or a twist outs. So, and the moist, oops, the oil helps with frizz, and it honestly, in my opinion, helps with definition a little bit. So, now that I did that, I'm just going to black twist my hair. I'll show you guys but just know look how shrunken my hair is. look but I don't know if twist I'm going to show you guys just because you know to are a lot but I'll definitely come back on when I'm done with my whole head or at least I'll show you you know maybe a couple more later when I get to this part of my hair so I'll be back stay tuned all right guys I'm back I've twisted up most of my hair I just have these two sections to go so I just thought I would do these two little I'm doing two more twists, so I thought I would do two of them on a camera so you guys could see a couple more times um, what I do. So my hair's still damp, and I do like flat twists out too because they're quicker, in my opinion, than doing a two strand twist or a three strand twist. Uh, you just kind of grab like a bigger chunk of hair, uh, twist it down, and you're good to go. Get my leave-in, do a little bit of this cream, like that, rub it in, check it there, rub it into my hair super good, and 
and like, I don't know, just making sure my hair is detangled and easy to run my fingers through, which this cream does, like so, so you can see <laughs> the definition. It's not rubbed in the best, but it'll soak in later. Take my oil, apply it directly to my scalp. A little bit on my hands, rub it in my hands, rub it on the hair, and mini scalp massage. And then I just twist it up super quick and look like so juicy. I love it. So, this is my last twist. I might put in one, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten twists. I'm about to head to bed. See you guys when I decide to take this out. Hey guys. Uh, I'm getting ready to take my twist. It's been one full day. And I did sit under the dryer um, for about 30, 30 to 40 minutes just to help it dry because everything was basically dry except for the back because these are thicker. But now everything is dry, so just a day is what I did to leave it in. I'm going to take probably a couple twists out on camera just so you can see. Just taking a little bit of oil, rubbing it on my palm, rubbing it on my hair, and... Alright, and we're going to do this. So I'll unravel the first twist, and... It's easy to unravel. Okay, okay, not mad right now. There's the first twist, so you guys could see it. I'm going to do the rest off camera. Actually, I'll come back to these two like I did when I was twisting it up. Then I'll give my final thoughts, products, reviews, verdicts, etc., etc. So I'll be right back. I'm back. It didn't take me that long to um, unravel these at all. I have about two more left. Like I said, I would show you guys. to be done I haven't went through and um, separated what else needed to be separated but this is just the first like without any without anything done to it basically and I am loving it so far minimal frizz guys minimal frizz it's not really shrunken either you guys know I love my other organics anyway so I'm whew, I'm so excited I tried this again because I was gonna give up on twist outs but this just proved me wrong. Let me go lay my edges. Let me go fluff it and do what I need to do. I'll come back with my final verdict and everything about the pros and cons, etc, etc. I'll be back. Alright guys, I'm back to give you my final um, pros and cons of the product. So, cons actually is none. I can't find anything wrong with this product at all. It gave me, so we'll just go into pros now. But it gave me a lot of volume. It's super moisturizing. A lot of definition. Very, like I said, minimal frizz. Like, I fluffed it. I've been outside already. Everything. And just, I'm loving it right now. So, I don't see any, any cons whatsoever with it. It smells amazing. It's, like I said, thick, creamy. I just, this is all I had to use. So, and it a little goes a long way with this product that you saw in the beginning. So I highly, highly, highly recommend you buy this. It's about $12.99. I know on their website, if you go to Sally, sometimes they have the sale. Really good twisting cream. So far, my number one. I think I'm going to start trying to do a twist out series with different creams and whatnot. And I'll keep you guys posted on what products you should use, what you shouldn't, etc., etc. If I haven't reviewed it already. But as of right now, this is number one in my twist out series. Um, I'm loving it. I'm loving it. The value, the definition. 
the moisturization. My hair feels super soft, bouncy, and it's super cute. Like, I just overall very cute. So, no complaints here whatsoever. I just jazzed it up a little bit. I picked it, I've done my edges, and I jazzed it up with these cute cold bobby pins. So, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked what you saw, comment, subscribe, uh, make sure you follow me on Instagram, and just keep giving me ideas of what you guys want to see what products you want me to try and thank you again for watching. I'll see you next time.